Won't you need some capable assistance? Well, here goes nothing. Dude, he just freaking renounced it. And he goes into... Where was this? Oh, young master, you still haven't rested yet? Oh, raison. There's one thing I want to ask you. What is it? Where was Sigurd born? Young master, that... He has blue eyes. It's the Fatima Jasper! Only the royal line has blue eyes! Well, it was long ago, when his majesty and I were still young, and my eyes were actually open for once. Long before his majesty, you, my young master's mother, his majesty was in love with a certain girl from a small religious sect east of Ave. The sect was quite different from Nissan and the ethos, but she was very beautiful. Then, she just disappeared. Later, there were rumors of her having a child. She disappeared? Did father abandon her? As far as I know, it was the opposite. His majesty was abandoned. It is from Ave's eastern desert. Indeed, when he was ten, he was assigned to His Majesty King Edward as a squire. Bastard baby. So we slowly walk throughout the palace. I mean, uh, there he is. What's up, half brother, young master? Yeah, I can't sleep. Yes, so much has happened at once. Hey Sid, what was your mother like? She died when I was but a child. Why? Do you have any memories of her? What kind of person was she? Well, she was very kind. But when I was born it seems the doctor told her she did not have long to live. She lived in constant fear of that. As a result, even if she met someone she liked, her fear of death was her drawback. She worried that she could not be with me to the very end. What about your father? He isn't supposed to know that I was born. However, even for not knowing, he still treated me like a son. Why didn't you tell him you were his son? If my mother hid that fact, there had to be a reason. There is more to my father's will than what I declared today. I must share my inheritance with my brother. He also said, You must split you and your brother's share with the people. That had always bugged me up until now. I didn't know what he meant. That's all I wanted. That's all I wanted to say. Good night. So, hey, Sig, I know. I know everything. Thanks to you, Ave has been taken back from Chacon and Debla. Thank you. Now, in order to free the other lands from Gebler and Solaris, we must destroy the other two gates and bring down Solaris. We've learned from Chacon's notes that the gates form the points of a triangle. One point was the Great Mausoleum. Two others remain. But we only know where one is. Yes, under the Ethos headquarters. However, it wasn't there when we followed Stone under the Ethos headquarters. If it really is there, it must be buried deep beneath the earth. Are we gonna destroy it then? Where's Josiah? No. Ugh. Choo Choo has a good idea. Gonna do with everyone's gear? Dig a giant hole in the ground? What's wrong with digging a giant hole in the ground? We'll end up in this world's equivalent to China. It would take years. What if we use Shavat's cannon? If that worked, we would have tried it already. Oh, my bad. So it must be something more powerful than Shabbat's cannon. And we don't have a Gebler battleship. 
What about the bot laser? Is there any weapon that powerful on Earth? Are we still calling it Earth? Whatever. Gabler battleships and Shavat cannons are the most powerful weapons ever produced by man. I should know. I was here the whole time. But I seem to remember seeing something. What? Open with firepower like those two. Yeah, I got it. Fart Chasper, her gun can take out a mountain. What about that? Sit so and what? However powerful the Jasper may be, how are we going to aim it at the Ethos headquarters? To damage something that deep underground, we would have to attack it from directly above. But the Jasper gun is... Uh, yes, of course. What, are you saying we should just move Fort Jasper on top of Babel? Now that you mention it, Babel does overlook their headquarters. If we shoot it from there, it might just possibly be able to reach that far underground. But how could we move Fort Jasper? It's impossible, something that heavy. Didn't the control room in Babel control a cannon or something? I think it moved the giant mirror outside. It did. Maria, do you know of anything like that? I've never heard anything about it, but... It might be there. Let's go check. Alright. Wait a moment. A giant mirror and a giant cannon, both from the same ruins. There might just be something in this. Like what? Spit it out, Satan. I have solved the puzzle, but I refuse to tell you until 30 parts from now. Puzzle? What puzzle? The Pebble and Jasper ruins are from the same civilization. Civilization. One far more advanced than our own. Do not the two structures seem similar to you? I believe they were both built with gears and a powerful foe in mind. Yeah, I noticed that. But what's it all mean? It means the people who built the giant mirror at, at Babel Tower knew about the giant gun at Jasper. And what are you getting at? You can probably assume the mirror was built to reflect something. With something being a beam, a beam shot from the Jasper gun! Reflect. That mirror can reflect a beam attack. Yes. Long ago, Babel and Jasper must have been at war. Not exactly. The Babel mirror and Jasper gun were combined to make one weapon. What do you mean? But those things are so far apart. How could they be one weapon? Well, the gates may be far apart, but aren't they still one device? Yes, I see what you mean, but... What did they use that weapon for? That, I do not know. Damn it, Satan. Whatever. The point is, how do we use the two weapons at once? And the Jasper gun at the mirror and fire. The mirror will reflect the beam on the gate. Do you think it'll work? Theoretically, it will require a few minor adjustments. Adjusting the mirror is going to be rather difficult and tedious. If the two weapons are one, it should not be too difficult, I hope. It sounds dangerous. I think it was meant to reflect shots back at the enemy. If you're wrong, it'll come back and hit you. Yes, that is why it's most difficult for the gun crew. The mirror must be hit precisely. We will need to divide into two teams. One will fire the gun, while the other will adjust the angle of the mirror to ensure the beam hits the ethos headquarters. Since this was my idea, I will take the dangerous part of adjusting the mirror. All right, Hugo. We'll let you take care of that. It seems like you're a top of job. I'll go too. Doc might need help, and I trust him more than anybody here. Just saying. It might be lonely with just a ten and Faye, so I had better go too. All right, you three take Babel. Oh, what about the gun? I'll do it. Looks like my kind of job. A near suicide mission. Don't worry. I won't miss. I haven't been using a gun for nothing. Well, I probably better go to the Jasper. Choo Choo wants to come. Then it's settled. Maria and Rico are useless. Rico is attending the mirror at the Ethos headquarters. We'll aim the Jasper gun at the mirror. Let's go back to the Yggdrasil and get going. with 
Shavat. Not only Shavat, the Ignis defeat, the Thames retreat, and yes, even Elru. You. Useless, as always. A failure to begin with. Trash. What did you just say? It's the truth. Just what is that attitude? You should show some loyalty. How dare you ridicule me by calling me trash? Damn you! Good. Calm down, Commander. It's not good for you. You still haven't recovered from the last battle. It does not matter. The lambs are probably on their way to destroying the gate. But not this time. I'd like to see your intrinsic powers. If you aren't the trash we think you are. They just vanish. Damn. Miang, launch the ship. Get to him. This time, I'll go myself. And I'll bring him down. Commander, you can't go out there like that. Commander, request permission to handle the situation. The elements. You all? We'll do our best to meet your expectations. Commander, please. You must get medical attention. To make our ideals a reality. We've defeated you all before. Well then, we are off. They're coming for us. All four of them. Can we take them? That's the question. Can we do all four at the same time? We've done them individually and then two at a time, but can we do all four? That's the question right now. Oh, don't we have... No. Hold on now. Just one second. 